Hi everybody, this is Larry Graves, the Canadian Stud Muffin, and welcome to Bad Grammar Lucky 13. This is my cat, Jinx. Isn't she thrilled looking to be in another Canadian Stud Muffin production? <clears throat> Put you down there. Roll over and play dead. Good girl! <clears throat> this is where I read Comments I get on my YouTube videos from uh, complete strangers. And as I've said in the past many times, I receive a lot of nice comments and I thank everybody for that. But occasionally I will get uh, a negative comment and it usually corresponds with some bad spelling or weirdness. Weirder than some of my videos. So here we go. And sometimes I speed up my voices in these, and it's not to make me more funny, because how can I get any funnier? <laughs> it's to speed up the video, so it, instead of it being like 10 minutes long, it might be 7 minutes long. So you only have a headache for 7 minutes instead of 10 minutes. Here we go. You have just wasted two minutes of my life, man, thanks a million. See, sometimes I do get nice comments, so thank you. Your Camry must be incredibly fast. Yes, it is. It's, it's quite fast. Now, I, I occasionally get a, an email on YouTube, and I love it when the, the heading says read. It's like, yes, I shall read. Then you go into it, and it says, to Canadian Stud Muffin. Hey, man, I love your video. I have a question. You can put me in your box, please. And if you don't know what that means, that means on my front page on YouTube, there's a box with, I think you can put 16, 16 other YouTube channels, so they get, you know, some, some views too. And so, of course, I have my, my good YouTube friends and my wife in the box, but I'll get uh, an occasional email from a complete stranger who probably hasn't even watched one of my videos asking me to put their channel in my box. And the answer is no! Get me mad. This is definitely the funniest thing I've seen on YouTube in quite a few years. I get that quite a lot, actually. I just saw my first video by you yesterday, and I can't stop watching them. You have a sense of humor that seems familiar, but it's not at all. You don't overdo your characters, but everything you do is absolutely hilarious. Holy, that's two good comments in a row. I'm, I'm looking out the window there because I ordered pizza. I'd rather eat pizza than do another stupid video like this. Sorry. And that was by... Cutery gents. So thank you for, for, very much for the kind words. I always read a, a comment or two that's nice. Who would find any of these videos funny? Well, obviously the, the person before. <laughs> Seriously, do you have some mental problem? Who here hates Fred Voicer over here? I just hate Fred. See, some people think because I, I do speed up my voice once in a while that I'm copying the very popular YouTuber Fred. But what these younger kids don't realize is there were speeded up voices long before Fred. In fact, I was doing speed it up voices long before Fred was. You lit rally just suck. You need to find something better to do than make horror bell videos. And this is from a, a, a good friend of mine, Rick Naylor. Here's the link for his YouTube channel. He builds a uh, nut chucks. Is that how you say it, Rick? I, I don't know. But, uh, you know those those big rocks and all that. And, and he wrote this on Facebook, so I thought I would have a part of the video. A friend at work says to me today, Who the hell is the Canadian stud muffin? I say, Oh, he is a good friend of mine. She says, He reminds me of Stephen King. I start laughing. Some friend. Now, I, I did a recent video on uh, Tim Horton's coffee. And, you know, people always want to start up an argument. And I just try and stay away from it. But this one kind of peeved me, because in the video I said that uh, Tim Horton started their first... Uh, coffee shop in the early 70s, and so this person wrote, he started a donut shop, not a coffee shop! So, I looked into it a little further, and uh, right from their website it says, direct from their, <clears throat> direct from their site, the first Tim Hortons restaurants offered only two products, coffee and donuts. So, I was at least partially right. I like the ones that are, are pretty plain and simple. And get right to the point. Your videos suck. You can't be serious. Yes, I can be. Watch. Okay. 
and another email I got on YouTube. Number one, comment this video and I will do on one of you videos. Number two, like this video and I will do on one of you videos. Three, favorite this vid and I will do on one of you videos. Dude, I want to punch you in the face. You're a complete faggot and a mama's boy. That really made me mad. <laughs> meow, meow. Wow, first of my friend, the guitar is out of tune and you got the guitar upside down and you're not using a pick. Fucking idiot. I hope I edited that out. <laughs> Hetty, could you sub to me and put me on you sub to my friends because I would love to be your friend. Everybody would love to be my friend. What is this? I don't even. Lots of laughter. Just great. Very funny. How do you keep your face so normal? I mean, isn't hard to... Don't laugh. Lots of laughter, just great, very funny. How do you keep your face so normal? I mean, isn't it hard not to laugh? That's what I'm trying to say. Uh, I really don't think I'm funny. That's why I don't laugh. I don't know why anybody laughs. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, that was good. Good acting. <sighs> Retarded. I'm gay and you made me straight. Thank you. See, I do, I do some wonderful things being on the internet with these videos. I hate you, you, Ursh Ho. Hey dude, can you teach me how to be an YouTube partner, please? Good job with the videos, by the way. Did anyone actually saw the whole video? It's 666, you id o it. It doesn't really help your cause when you're attempting to call somebody an idiot and you can't spell idiot. That's just... Yeah. Oh my god, I saw it until the end I have a head ache. I need to get my brown thing out and my yellow thing. I still have time to write this comment, but I think I'm going to die. Joke. <laughs> it's, just, it's just joking. Whew. Someone should kill you. Jinxie, back off. The look in her eyes. Oof. You're old. Lots of laughter. <laughs> After a fact! You are really big dumb. If you try to move your camera, maybe I will believe it. But now I know it was a lie. Maybe who was believed that's your brother. They are not stupid, but they don't know. Please watch on 0.27 second. The shadow on the car was stop, which means he cut out the car and make the car move in kind of after effect software. This is really bullshit. Of course, it doesn't have special effect. Haha, <laughs> I take a trick. Really idiot. This is insulting to me because I have a foot fetish. See, I've got a video called the, uh, I think it's called the, the Foot Fetish Song, which was originally called the Sock Song, so I'm taking off my socks, and it's just a silly little, but, you know, some people actually get upset. This is insulting to me, because I have a foot fetish. I guess he didn't lick my feet. I guess he didn't lick my feet. <laughs> you must have been extremely bored to make something this long, but it's still cool, I guess. Oh, and your wife has a nice bikini. Okay, a minute 30 into this, and it is gay! Whoa, you're not 53. What the jack? Oh my god, why do Canadians look so young? <coughs> well, there are Canadians that are 53, and they don't look so young. But I think it helps that... And my wife is basically the same age as I am, 53. She's going to be 53 in August. And I think it's mainly because neither of us has smoked. And I drink a little bit of alcohol, but not too much. So, you know, we haven't really been big drinkers or smokers. And, uh, and I've also been doing a lot of intuitive dancing. Which helps me to stay young. I don't want to show off right now. <clears throat> you look like Stephen King. Jinxie, you should smile more. You always look so miserable. She really is a nice cat, but she, she looks kind of miserable. And she sleeps with Deb and I every night. She's a real sweetheart of a cat. And she? And you've only clawed out my eyes a couple of times. And you know one thing I never said in the video, Jinx? I never said... Big smile!